Welcome back, guys, to Firewatch. Uh, just got a new haircut. We're, I don't know if it's good or not, but I hope it's good. We're going to hop into this part four. If you haven't watched the other episodes, then I recommend you to watch the whole playlist. I'll just put the link somewhere here. And then, yeah, last time we got to the fence over there. But then we found out that we actually couldn't get through it because it's a lock. And then once we found that lock, we asked Delilah how to get in. And she said we have to go to the scout camp and ask some people there how to get in there or i don't yeah something like that so now we're gonna head on over all the way there which is literally like the other side of the map so this is gonna take a while but yeah so i actually looked up how long this game is and it's only about five hours so we could be done with this game soon i had a feeling we were kind of close to the end although i kind of expected the game to be a bit longer but it's okay because we also got elden ring in a couple days so i want to record that too but i wanted to be done with this game before we started playing elden ring but yeah so expect the dlc uh once we're done with this game all right got some more music this is nice and peaceful but isn't wasn't this a dead end oh the trees are burnt down look at this map updated i found where they did the controlled burn i can hike right through here now yeah, Sir. normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river and burning up to two forks now that there's someone Damn, in Damn, look at this. Well, I'm extra appreciative of that. Let's see. The scout camp is southeast of the river. There should be a pond on the way. Got it. What happens if a controlled burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. <laughs> Get it? Fired? Ugh, are you serious? Oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. I'm not even in the mood for wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. Some old snowmobiles out here. That's crazy. Looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across this pond and dumped it. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. What happened? Can I use them? Please? No. Uh, there's an old pond out here. Not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah, I know where you are. Yeah? Where am I? Pork Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but, um, well, folks kept stealing it. Pork Pond. Uh, because it's called Pork Pond? It's a good goddamn name. That sign would look great in a den, or... Oh, wait. You know, anywhere. The bridge to the camp is out. Damn. I'm gonna walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. Oh, here. Let's go. You ever talk to any of the scouts? No, they haven't been out here in a while, and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens. Unless it's Brian Goodwin. Well, if forced, I mean, I can make conversation with anyone. Plus, it was sort of fun to hear about all of his nerdy hobbies. What type of nerdy hobbies are we talking about with him? Like, a marching band? Oh, no, 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 no. Like, comics, model rockets, wizards and wyverns, you know. Oh. Hey, thanks to Brian, I can almost recall by memory the armor classes of most dragons. Yeah, I don't care. Uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the weeblos. For the past 35 years, yeah. Oh, a bear trap? There are bear traps out here in the scout shelters. Scouts are stalwart prey. <laughs> That's messed up. I don't even know why I got scared. Nothing even happened. But what do we got here? Not yeah, here. these guys are gone. I found where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Ooh. Uh, I found an axe. Oh yeah, if give me that. left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. It looks like an Not axe a weapon. To me. This thing will be a huge help. For both getting through the backcountry and getting through that fence. Hey D, they left something behind. It's uh, like a memo from, uh... from their boss. Hmm. Huh. Uh, next few days, dropping into the third thoroughfare oh. on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Poverty Station. Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there. Let the mystery percolate. My mother always said I would meet someone who'd give me a taste of my own medicine. Oh, well, they knew it was going to burn. There. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that, that, that we don't know about? What are they researching? Us, maybe? Us. They're researching us. You, you think they're studying you and me? I do, yeah. I mean, maybe it's about studying two strangers who talk every day. Oh, yeah. Like, if you put someone mm. in isolation with someone else, what they do. Yeah, that's what I think. 
Well, fuck that. Agreed. Oh. I think we should allow for the possibility that this is all just a big misunderstanding, but... God, if you saw what you said you did... Fuck, Henry. Yeah, I saw it. Hey, I don't know, okay. bub. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so I can figure out a way to get over to the room. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Check in when you can, and keep an eye out for anyone following you. Yep. I'm gonna try to. I mean, last time I got KO'd in the back of my head. Hey, buckaroo. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Are you there? I, I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Or you are, at least. Where are you right now? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No. no, definitely not. All right, so uh, tell me what you think of this. <laughs> cough. What was Did that? You just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, oh fuck. fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone like another lookout could be on this line, is there? Not without tapping our radios. Get in your tower, shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Yes, ma'am. Oh, day 77. What the heck? Uh, so it's getting a little more intense. What's gonna happen now? I mean, she told us to get back to the tower. Are we just gonna camp there? Oh, I guess so. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. The June fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, oh, hello. went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? Why are you so chipper? I didn't sleep a wink last night, and I've been going crazy for the past six hours of sunup. How are you so chipper? Well, it's a new day. What a day, this day we've been given. Maybe I am actually asleep right now. Someone reset her. All night knowing that someone is... I actually slept just great. Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Why is she talking like this? Uh, uh, alright. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Examine the flora poster. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Um, yeah. Cotton Let me look at it and I'll tell you. No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. It's, it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Oh. She's talking like this because they're spying on us. I'm I'm a bit slow, but Conwood, where is that? Oh here, Conwood Creek. Yep. So do I just head there? Or I'm supposed to examine it still? Oh, uh yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I oh, tell now. you. Now, okay. Radio me the moment you get there. This should be Cottonwood Creek. Lila, am I like gonna meet you or don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing? been going around for like five minutes what am i supposed to be doing is am i waiting for like a cutscene? wait what one two three four doesn't work uh i'm here I'm here though. wood creek you see the cash box there yeah i just checked it and the code doesn't work it's because i changed it oh. it's five six seven eight are you kidding me i was in a rush got a new radio oh I've got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. <laughs> I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry. We have to get into that site. <laughs> Break into Uppity Metal. Um... Whatever these people are doing is illegal, right? Tell me everything right now. All of it. You know what's going on, and you're going to tell me right this minute. Why would you think... I know what the hell is going on. <laughs> I, I, I snuck out in the middle of the night and figured out how to get you a new untapped radio because, because what, I'm fucking with you? 
I think so. The important thing, Henry, is that we don't turn on each other. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Maybe you're not real. You're not real. Maybe I'm losing my mind. What? Like Julia. What happened to Julia? Uh, nothing. Um, nothing. It, uh, it doesn't matter. Just maybe there was something in the water or our condo was underneath some power lines and and you Delilah you're not real Henry you are losing it <laughs> I don't know everything that's happened to you but you have to pull yourself together okay I am real okay mm. Henry sweetie I am real and this is happening I'm as real as the sky is blue take a second and then call me back sweet I'm on your side okay I'm all right I'm uh, I'm headed towards the site Good. Keep your head up. Hey, uh, I just thought of something not, um, not great. What? What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that went missing a few weeks back. Wait, what? So? I'm sorry, I, I'm not following you. Right. Henry, our radios were tapped the entire time we talked about it. Maybe even your first day when you had the run-in with them. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, yes. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. And I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Oh, and those girls are still missing. Yep. Wait, what? I don't get it. We really need to get to the bottom of this. I uh, I don't I'm not following this right now. I'm gonna have to rewatch this because I I don't understand the story so far. Like I'm so dumb when it comes to like playing a game, recording, and actually pay, playing a ten play paying. Oh my god! What the fuck? Oh hell no! Uh, I just heard something. What is it? I I don't know. It was goddamn terrifying. It sound like a well, it could be an elk, or it could be someone trying to get you to radio about a loud noise so they know where you are. That did not sound great. I'm sorry that I'm this slow, but like I said last time, every time I record, I cannot follow the story because I don't know why. I'm, I guess I'm not that used to like recording and actually talking like a uh, commentary and attach. What? What is this? Yeah, I'm slow when it comes to actually talking and paying attention to the storyline. I'm very sorry, guys, but I'm not this slow in real life. Please, I'm 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 sorry. Like I'm not I'm not this slow in real life. I know it's like sudden cuts where I talk, but it's like I don't know why. But it's just recently my commentary has been very bad. It's just go been going downhill. I don't know why. I'm like dyslexic or I don't freaking know. I wasn't like this before, but. And I went the whole other way. Bro, this game is so hard. A few moments later. Can this guy run faster? Damn, you slow. Oh, we made it. Finally. All right, let's try and open this now. Hmm. <clears throat> finally. I smashed open the gate. Should I try to fix or hide this? No, screw it. Okay, then. Uh, oh! Get out of here. What's this? If you're trying to reach Dr. Simmons, he is on site from August 15th to October 15th. Government owned equipment is under the purview of Cat Ferdinand. Remember, this is a controlled area and any issues, malfunctions, or violations should be reported immediately. All right. Well, I just got a bee sting. What? Uh, okay. Guess I didn't get to report that. See what is going on in this place because I mean we heard weird stuff about this place, but now let's see what's actually going on here. Okay, I'm at the site. I don't see anybody around. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. The there is some serious comms equipment out here, wireless stuff. What do you mean? I'm talking a big Whoa. twenty foot tall transmission tower. I mean they could probably listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. Now they're doing something with the soil out here too. It's all gridded off. Uh, who knows what else they're up to? Is this like the government doing this? I mean, there are all sorts of contraptions and shit out here. Like what? Dishes and stuff on metal legs. There are wires all over the place. I don't know. I'm not really up on high tech. I mean, how the hell did they get all this stuff out here? 
The Army Corps of Engineers put our towers out here, so... You think it was the government? I have no idea. I, I just mean... Why would they be here? I mean, every once in a while, I'll meet a lookout who's deep into that, like, black helicopter conspiracy shit. Maybe they actually flew it out here in one of those. I'm in their main tent. What's it like? It's definitely some sort of monitoring station. I just I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. I think I found the thing they used to track us. Holy shit. Whoa. You know, you swear, like, a lot. Not the time, Hank. What anyway, it's this? called a wave receiver. It looks like it picks up anything that emits a signal. It's got basic orienteering oh. capabilities, everything. Holy... Oh, shit. Holy shit, Henry. Yeah, holy shit. You're gonna take it, right? Yeah, of course. Black box. What's that? Subjects Henry and Delilah. 43, 39. Oh, she's older than me? Whoa. There's a folder of reports here. They know everything about what us. They say? They're assessments about the two of us. It says things about my life. S stuff you don't know. Like what? Stuff I didn't tell you. This is... What, what does it say about me? You said there was one about me. And it looks like they've been following me around. What I do when I'm out hiking? Jesus! Henry, do you hear me? You have a boyfriend, Javier? What the oh. fuck? Oh! <laughs> Wish you hadn't left that out. I don't. I I didn't. This is insane. I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. Damn. Think about it. Look, maybe that's what they want us to do. What do you mean? M maybe they're trying to push us to the point where we do something crazy. I mean, the grass is dry as hell here. It would go up in a second. Well, now I'm... Thinking, what if you're right? I, I just don't think we should do anything that we can't undo. Well, maybe it's not the best idea. Yeah, it's got this jam here, though. Can I eat idea. it? Ah, so fucking wound up. It's all right. I'm just gonna hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. Oh my god, go all the way back. Now that is a beard. A beard, really? Now that is a bit weird because why is the government here or at least someone that has like high tech stuff is here and is observing us and is just trailing us. I don't know why, like we are just two random people. Uh, what's that? Oh shit. Whoa. Whoa. Oh shit. Whoa. What? I think there is smoke coming from north of Jonesy Lake. That oh, is suspiciously shit. close to where you just were. Do you see it? Just, okay, yeah, I see it. What the hell happened to you? It's definitely not the best idea. It wasn't me. <sighs> right. What do we do? Uh, we just call it in like any other fire. And what about who started it? What about them? I don't uh, know. The person who started it? Yeah. We're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I, I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. Oh, it's the same day. What the heck? Why are they showing this? Maybe it's later on in the day. Who is listening to us? This receiver just picked something up. It's like a signal. It's going beep beep. Yeah. yeah, what could it be? I don't know. You gotta find out. Alright, I'm on my way now. I... You know what I just picked up? Uh, what? no. A fifth of Major Bueno Tequila from the creek. Are you drunk? <laughs> no! I am getting drunk! Really? Now? Hey D, I don't want to harsh your vibe, but maybe, just maybe, that's a bad idea. Henry, Henry, Henry. What? You're harsh in my vibe. My thinking is I could stay up all night worried I'm gonna lose my job because of the side fire, or Bruh. I could not worry and let the chips fall where they may. It's not like there's any proof we were down there. My thinking is I'm gonna follow this wave receiver. 
I like it when you think. Ay ay ay. I'll just leave you alone with whatever these thoughts are. <laughs> Radio off. Follow the wave receiver. All right, it's getting warmer. We gotta go this way. Uh oh. Here, it's another backpack. Shit! Oh shit! Uh, uh smash it. Key. Cave four five two. See, I I found some sort of supply bag, light camping gear, some clothes, and basics. But it was alarmed. I think that's what was making the receiver go haywire. Yep. You're okay? It's not a trap or anything? Yeah, I'm fine. But there's there's also a set of keys here. I don't know why they'd be hidden out here. They say Shoshone National Forest, Cave 452. Is that the one in the canyon? Yeah, it is. <sighs> Who the hell took them? And what the hell is in that cave? Okay, okay, let's just think. Says the woman with a half a bottle of tequila in her belly. Maybe they're panicking and we're preparing to beat it. The fire has them spooked and we have new walkie-talkies, so we have the upper hand. Yeah, well, it's hard to feel like you have the upper hand when you're standing in the dark in the middle of the woods. Oh. Well, you're back in your tower. Maybe you need a drink, too. I'm not in my tower. I am looking at a man standing in your lookout. And it's not... Oh, me. hell no. It is not me. Oh my god, go. Uh, who is on my tower? What the heck? Yo, I got an axe though. I'm about to kill him. Yo, who is at my tower? I got an axe, so I'm gonna just ask him a question. No, okay. Alright, this is a bit creepy. But I'm not a pussy, yo. So, uh... What? No one here. I don't see anyone up here. She was just there. Oh, they set up an alarm. Cassette player taped or to my damn cassette door. Cassette player? Don't even know what to say to that. Well, what does? see what's on it. Oh no! The tape of us talking down at the site. It sounds like it was recorded from somewhere nearby. Oh Jesus! Yeah, and. It sounds like we were the ones who burned it down and that it was your idea. Bruh. No. We are screwed. No. No. He, just don't freak out, okay? Don't freak out. Oh my god, what the fuck is happening, Henry? I, I don't know. Okay, next day. Uh, I don't, I'm, I don't know what to say right now. It's a lot of weird stuff going on. That quality, though. What's wrong? Someone claiming to be Henry in Two Forks called a lookout in another sector early this morning and said that I knew what caused the Wapiti Meadow fire. Um. So I just got off the horn with that lookout who's wondering what I know, or that I'm an arsonist, or that I'm fucking losing it. Furthermore, I bet you don't have the only tape of us from last night, so someone has evidence to back it up. We need to find out what someone's been keeping in that cave. I'm going down there now. We don't have a lot of time left out here, and if we don't find some fucking answers, when they lift us out of here, it's gonna be in handcuffs. We just, we have to stick together, okay? Keep our story straight, from the first day with those girls to the person breaking in on our conversation, everything. We just, we gotta be honest and consistent. Yeah. I suppose you're right. I know. Well, all right, guys. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. So next episode, it could be the final episode. I don't know, but we're going to be exploring that cave. We need to find out who's doing this to us, but we'll do that in next episode because I have run out of time for today. Stay tuned for the next episode. I'll catch you guys later. Don't forget to stay positive and peace out.